Good afternoon. The province of Ontario has entered stage three of the reopening. Many businesses and public spaces will reopen following the public health advice and workplace safety guidance necessary to keep everyone safe. As we saw in the stage two reopening, there remains a risk. Although we are taking gradual steps in the stage three reopening, the COVID-19 pandemic is certainly not over. We will see new cases and outbreaks, and as a community, we are prepared to respond quickly and effectively. The virus is sneaky, it's aggressive, and it wants to spread in our region. It is very much present in our province and continues to pose a risk to our community. The simple things are still the most important things. Wash our hands frequently. Maintain a physical distance of two meters from others. Maintain a small social circle of a maximum of 10 trusted and dependable people. Wear a face covering in required locations. If you get ill, stay home and get tested for COVID-19. Stage three has allowed most businesses and public spaces to reopen. To complement them, we have made amendments to our mandatory mask order. Face coverings are not required in the following instances. In indoor physical activities, including fitness studios and gyms. However, we recommend that an individual wear a face covering when going to and from the activity or equipment. Restaurants or cinemas while actively consuming food or drink. A face covering must be used when an individual leaves their seat. An emergency procedure in a medical facility. Religious leaders providing sermons or speeches in places of worship. Schools, day camps, and childcare facilities. The school board specific recommendations on face coverings must be followed. Remember that not everyone can wear a face covering. Some individuals with pre-existing medical issues may have difficulty wearing a face covering. We should accept those exemptions respectfully and in good faith. We must all continue to work together to make sure that the KFLA region opens safely for everyone. Our challenge now is to avoid a, a spike in cases and overwhelming our healthcare system. Please continue to be resilient, to be kind and a caring community. Be safe and look out for others who are vulnerable. We're all in this together. We each have a role to play.